Anticipation is growing for further achievements in economic cooperation and the aerospace industry between South Korea and the U.S. as the two leaders, Mr. Yoon and Mr. Biden, sit down for talks. Our Lee Soo-jin takes a look at one of the most promising future sectors. Surging demand for space exploration activities and aircraft equipment is expected to further advance the aerospace industry. The global space economy, valued at over 460 billion U.S. dollars last year, is expected to reach over 730 billion within a decade, while airlines are expected to need more than 41,000 new aircraft over the next 20 years. South Korea has already made strides in its space research with the country's first lunar orbiter, Tanuri, developed by the Korea Aerospace Research Institute with contributions from NASA. According to an expert, further inter-country collaborations in the space sector can be expected in the future. Uh, collaboration with the U.S. will really uh, help Korea to extend the space exploration uh, capacity. Also, it is highly expected that U.S. and Korea will seek for collaboration in Artemis program, uh, which is an international collaboration framework for manned lunar missions scheduled in 2027 for human uh, uh, back, back to the moon. Uh. The economic impact of the aerospace industry is not only large, but also far-reaching. Well, uh, our daily lives uh, already uh, depend on space technology uh, in many ways. Uh, for, for example, satellite broadcasting, uh, weather forecasting, uh, other areas such as space tourism, uh, asteroid mining, uh, space debris removal, and manufacturing space could be considered as principal areas uh, which will promote future space economy. Cooperation between South Korean and U.S. companies has already begun with domestic companies providing crucial commercial aviation engine parts. We are currently a key global provider of engine parts for the big three aviation engine manufacturers, the U.S.'s General Electric and Pratt & Whitney and the U.K.'s Rolls-Royce. Countries and companies are also currently ramping up their cooperation in the space and aircraft sectors. Meanwhile, U.S. company Boeing's Defense, Space and Security Division CEO, Theodore Colbert, met with South Korea's Trade Minister Lee Chang-yang last Thursday to discuss signing an MOU for joint R&D projects in the aerospace sector with details to be finalized within the year. Lee Soo-jin, Arirang News.